Hey guys! I am here to review the Bar Mix Cocktail Shaker. Now, it is a 100% stainless steel cocktail shaker. And what I like about stainless steel cocktail shakers is that they get the drinks cold fast when you're using ice. So in this, you get the bottom part where you put your ice and drink. And then the top looks like this. And the opening is from here. And it's got a strainer on it. So you don't have to worry about the strainer falling out when you take your drink out. You just got to hold the top and then just pour. So here's what it looks like together. Looks like this. And it comes with a jigger also, which is what you use to measure out your alcohol. And the bigger part is 1.5 ounces, and the small part is 7. Point, no, not 7. Point, point 0.75 ounces. And the cocktail shaker itself holds 24 fluid ounces. Yes. Okay. So, when I used this, it it became very cold very quickly, which is what I like in a cocktail shaker. I want things to get cold. And when you use your plastic one, it doesn't feel like it's evenly getting cold because metal is a very good conductor and it just gets everything cold. And that's what I really love about this cocktail shaker. And let's see. It's dishwasher safe since it's stainless steel and it's really easy to clean by hand even if you don't want to use dishwasher because all you got to do is clean this cap, take apart the top, that's easy to clean, and the bottom part. And let's see, where's that thing? Oh, it says it on the lid, okay. On the lid it says, oh it's really reflective, I don't know if you can... It says Bar Mix Cocktail, which is the brand name, and I really love it. The cap's easy to take off, but it won't fly off. Ooh, the top will fly off though, but this part will not fly off. So when you're shaking it, I recommend you hold it when you shake it, or else, because this part kind of comes out a little bit. So you don't want your whole thing. I mean, you're supposed to hold it like this anyways when you're shaking it. So it shouldn't, you shouldn't be holding it like this when you're shaking it. And let's see, there's tons of recipes I found online for like non-alcoholic cocktails because I can't drink it. I will be able to in a couple months, but I can't drink it. So I've made this drink called the Rehydrator and it had cranberry juice, aloe juice, uh... Marchino cherries and lime juice and it was a very sweet tart drink and if you want to try that out I'll put the recipe in the link so yeah I would recommend this for any cocktail connoisseurs and thanks for watching